I really didn't do well with women my age at the time. I was in my early 20s. What's your age? Shut up. I was in my, <laughs> I was in my early 20s. And uh, when you're in your early 20s, the women your age don't want you. You know, I want a mature guy who's like 27. <laughs> So what young guys have to do to adapt is they have to skip a couple generations <laughs> and date what, they, what you call cougars. These are older women that go for younger guys. And so I went through a cougar phase. And I remember one time I was in this bar in Florida and these women were aggressive, okay? I'm talking like redneck, you know, like, they're like, oh boy, you are well bred. <laughs> that sounds oddly racist, but. <laughs> And I remember talking to this woman, and I was like, you know, what do you, what do you look for in a man? She said, it's a pulse. <laughs> so, like, this is gonna work. I got one of those. So I thought, I thought this woman in particular, she's wearing a leopard print coat. She had nice hair. She looked very good for 63. She looked very good for 63. But people wonder, am I gonna still be having sex in my 60s, you know? And she, she looked good. This was a few years ago, so now she's, you know, dead and <laughs> she convinces me that she has money she's like well i got a couple properties so i'm thinking like okay i can get some inheritance here. <laughs> think positive right and I, and she was just so confident with herself it just it just sucked me in and i just loved being around because she just liked me for me she didn't care that i was you know homeless and <laughs> So we end up going back to her house, one of, one of her properties. Now, one of her properties turns out to be a trailer oh. in a trailer park. Now there's Confederate flags everywhere, all right? People shooting guns, there's crocodiles, it's real Florida, okay? I'm feeling so scared, like this is a setup, right? Like at any second they're gonna say, fucking get him! So, I'm nervous, I go into this woman's trailer and I sit down and she immediately makes me comfortable by pulling out this green tank. And I was like, well, what is this? Are we going scuba diving? And she says, oh no, boy, you know, before I get it on, I gotta get a little oxygen in me. Right? And I was like, oxygen? She's like, well, in my old age, you know, I don't really have one. She's like, do you want some? Of course, Grandma. <laughs> so we both put on this oxygen, inhaling it. I'm getting high. She's getting high. She's telling me how she has a few black friends and has a white lady that she was always so glad she could do this now that segregation is over. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, you got a weird way of seducing people. <laughs> but the oxygen hits you, so I, I just thought, like, yeah. I'm doing this for my ancestors. <laughs> I'm getting high, just, she's getting high, and then she goes and she changes, and she pulls out, and she has a corset on from like, you know, like the fucking flapper era, you know, that shit, the, Char the Charlie Chaplin shit. And I'm thinking, I can't, I can't do this. I was 20 something at the time, and she's, she's like 40 years older than, older than me. I was like, I can't fucking do this. But then I thought, you know, come on, man, you're like, fucking respect your elders, okay? <laughs> It's like community service, bro. Like, right? you know, if you're 60, wouldn't you want a, a young buck? To <laughs> and so I was like, all right, we'll just go in the bedroom. We'll just maybe I'll just cuddle, you know. So we're we're there, and I, and she just had this sexual energy that's been developed over like 40 years. It just it, it was just scary, and I just like I don't, I'm just so turned on, but I don't want to be. It just wasn't a choice. You know, she's like, we gonna do this. I'm gonna show you. And I was like. I'm still trainable. And, it's, <laughs> and she just pulls down my pants. I was like, oh my God, this is so bad. It's just I mean, she still had her teeth. It's not like she went with <laughs> I'm telling you, 63 is not that old. You're going to get there one day and you'll be glad that you're still fucking. Uh, it's a, if you're wondering, did I do it? Uh, you're goddamn right. I fucked grandma. Like, so. It was the wildest sex I ever had. Cause she was teaching me all these things. She's like, I'll show you. And so I'm done and she's on top. And she's like, boy, I'm gonna ride you like a carousel in the county fair. And I'm like, what is this? So she's going for it. The trailer's shaking. And next thing you hear something pop. And I was like, what's that? She's like, my hip, keep going. And I was like, I fucked this old woman so hard. And she loved it the whole way. But I was still, this is at this point in my life, I was still just so, not sure about my sexuality. And for a lot of men, we're not sure 
especially when you're young, but we always pretend like we know what we're doing. And because we watch porn and we think we're experts, I watch, I got about a thousand hours <laughs> of research. But that's not real. And a lot of times in porn, the guy doesn't make the woman come first because these videos would all be like four hours long. So you have to make the woman come first. That's what she told me. She's like, make sure I get there first, boy, and then you can do what you want. I was like, oh shit, I didn't realize that. Because up until that point, I would always, you know, in the throes of the passion, you hope that the woman's gonna come at the same time, and you kind of, you're doing a thing where you're like, eh, yeah, you too, yeah, 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 yeah you close, cause I'm, yeah, 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 you know what, you just have fun, you go ahead, it's okay, it's, it's fine, that's it, uh, friends and tell it is terrible it's, um, and you don't give him any feedback no no <laughs> so I, i'm sitting in the bed and i was there i was wondering like hey was that was that was that good enough you know grandma and she turns to me and she says boy service at the club so we gotta go to the fucking senior citizens home and and they teach they teach you how long was your your cougar around for twice Tw okay yeah. yeah once and then she but I, I never talked about it until now <laughs> yeah yeah see it's, it's like therapy are you are you are you here with someone my wife <laughs> Look at Russia turning around. You'll be single soon. <laughs> All right, next question, next question. How long? How long? Thank you for finishing that question. I'm <laughs> very uncomfortable. How long? Don't tell me your name is Jesus. How long to finish the process? You mean how long was it for us to have sex? How long did the relationship last? No, no, how long did the... The, the sex. Yeah, yeah it's a strange way of asking. <laughs> how long was the session of... <laughs> fucking... <laughs> how long... You asked that in... In sections, that was great. How long... <laughs> was the project... <laughs> of fucking... Uh, where are you from? Engineer, huh? How long was the project of fornication? Be long as if you I I don't remember because I was high off of oxygen, so it was long enough to put her hip back into place. Yeah, man. Her name was Diane. She was uh, she's great, great, great lady. Diane, dirty Diane. <laughs> Next question. Did you get any of the houses? Did I get any of the houses? That's my wife. Is that what you're waiting for? For his? I was like, honey, don't worry. She got Bitcoin back in the early days. We're gonna be loaded. Uh, 
<laughs> yeah, no, take it out of the houses. No, no, it's still poor. It's still poor. So, you know, if you want to donate to a, a little black child, uh, <laughs> <laughs> the Niglet Fund. <laughs> you got a friend real interested in that. You got a friend who's a chocolate chaser? No, 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 no. Oh, you can't hide. This is, this is live, not Netflix. We see you. What's your name, chocolate chaser? Filipa. Filipa, where are you from? Portugal. Portugal. How long have you been into dark chocolate? <laughs> Since I remember, maybe 15. Since you remember. <laughs> you have a good way of making things weird. I think you'd be a good match with a German guy. Right? How long? <laughs> What's your session? <laughs> with the Schwarzman? Yeah, since I can remember, my first memory was at three years old. <laughs> You made us. You made it very uncomfortable. Uh, we all think that the worst has happened to you. So, but it's good. So, when's the last time you got a black boy? Uh, when's the last time you had a black guy? Maybe a month ago. Damn, bitch. Oh. <laughs> Pussy's like an NGO. Shit. When's the last time a black guy was inside of you? That's great. Congratulations. How'd you, where'd you find him at an Afrobeat party? <laughs> Yeah. MC's got one Afrobeat party, and I always go, and the best part about it, these black dudes don't know how to dance Afrobeat, but you white people don't know the difference. <laughs> so like, this is how you do it. <laughs> and culture. Uh, that's great. And what do you do for a living now, other than uh, spread diversity? I work in compliance. Compliance. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, good luck. Good luck. Uh, you'll find someone. <laughs> Chocolate. Is any black guys here? Two. <gasps> A Negro. <laughs> but you're taking them. Yeah. I'm sorry. Oh, it's not for me, bro. <laughs> where'd, you, where'd you Where'd you find him? Okay, it's easy when you're looking for a black dude on Tinder. It's like, no, 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 I guess we're getting married. Here in Barcelona, there's really not that many. I mean, there's a few. You can count them. Next question. How long did you live in Germany? How long did you live in Germany? Mr. Deutscher? Nein. Woher kommst du? Spain. Okay. I don't know about that. Alle sprechen Sie Deutsch? Ja, gut. Hast du ein äh, deutsches Band gewählt? Nee? Warum nicht? <lacht> Jesus. So this is all you wanted to talk about. How long have you been in Germany? Tell me what you don't like about them. Where are you from? You're from Spain? Where are you from? You're from Spain, that's right, okay. Good. <lacht> What's question? Shut up and stop ruining the fucking jokes. Jesus. It's like great timing, something good was coming. He's like, get down, get down. When was your first memory? <laughs> okay. There's still time. Uh, what do you like doing for fun? Other than coming to comedy shows, do you have a, a life? What's your What's your life other than looking good? Do I have a mic? Do you have a mic? Look, if you're gonna flirt with me, you have to make sense, okay? <laughs> This is fucking confusing as shit. She's, it's great, she's hot. She's like, I'm hot, I don't have to make sense. What do you do for fun? Do you have a mic? Oh. Isn't it great being a hot girl? Look at she doesn't even care. She's like, I know. I still get in VIP, don't care. Uh, is, there, is there any other single black dudes here? Yeah. What is your name, though? Yeah, this is for you. Kati. 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 K
Ekati. Oh, you're the Ekati. Okay, well, Ekati, is, is it your birthday coming up soon? Yes. When? Actually, in 15 days is what it says on passport. <laughs> I have to study it to make sure I get in past security agents. Okay, well, here, have a seat. You're, you're gonna get the birthday present for the day. <laughs> Just bitch, sit the fuck down. All right, so you got, so this isn't the Grammys, okay.